in this spectacular show car, uh, we call it ABTR, Advanced Vehicle Transformation. It's really a car where man and machine merge. And through a control unit, uh, once you touch it, the car feels that you're there. It can feel your pulse, your breathing. It's so intuitive, if you just put out your hand, it gets projected onto your hand what you want to do, and you can control the car from the palm of your hand. So an intuitive experience like we have never seen before. What really uh, unites us uh, is the quest to push the boundaries of technology. Uh, Lightstorm, his company, has always been about, you know, how do you get to the next technological edge of filmmaking, which is what we're trying to do in the car business, the inner unrest for what's next, always pushing beyond, always thinking about uh, what the next great thing is and letting your energy, your fantasy, uh, your creativity work for you. But that's not the only thing. It's also about sustainability. Uh, that's what the Avatar movie is about. It's a message uh, to bring harmony between man and nature. And that's also what we want to do with our sustainable business model. Make sure that mobility in the future has zero impact on nature. Under the banner of Ambition 2039, uh, we have set ourselves a clear target. In 20 years time, three product life cycles, we want to make our new car fleet carbon neutral. But that's not the only thing that we're talking about here tonight. We're also talking about decoupling the usage of resources from our growth. How can we, through reduction, reuse and recycling, make sure that what we do and the business that we are growing, uh, we use less materials and we have less of an impact on the environment? Uh, that's what uh, the message is about today, tonight.